In our previous video, we compared spot and forward prices on a relative basis. Now in this video, we'll explore two potential patterns, contango and backwardation. The usual spread between prices tells us that forward prices are higher than current prices. This situation, referred to as contango, is quite typical due to a variety of factors such as inflation, insurance, storage, and the investor psychology. However, forward prices may also fall below the current market price either on a short-term basis or for a sustained period. And when this happens, investors refer to backwardation, which might occur when there has been or there is expected to be a shortage of the product in the near term, yet production is widely expected to resume in the coming weeks and months. Backwardation gets right to the very heart of imminent supply and demand. Now, at this point, you may be wondering why your next door neighbor invests in corn or crude oil, and yet you haven't seen their backyard crammed with stocks of corn or flooded in petroleum. This is primarily because investors in the futures market are able to transact and take positions in and yet never actually own the commodity or product they invest in. At the same time, the liquid nature of most futures markets makes it a viable environment for producers to offset risk and ultimately transact physical delivery. Now, in our next video, we'll take a closer look at futures contracts and provide you with an example of a standardized crude oil contract. We'll look forward to you joining us then.